Hey guys, what is up? I am back with another haul, a huge fashion haul, so I can't wait to share with you everything I got. So many fun Halloween items and fall items. I'm so excited that I already dug into one of the boxes and I just got one just a few minutes ago. I was gonna do this in my bedroom, but I was already set up in here and my bedroom's kind of a mess, so I figured I would just go ahead and share with you what I got so far. I actually placed a big order and only about half of it is here, but I figured I would show you what I got now because I'm gonna dig it out and pretty much like disperse it everywhere and I won't remember what I got. But I wanna first start out with a Shein order. Guys, I haven't ordered from Shein in like over a year. Um, so I was like, you know what, let me go see what they have. Let me check it out. And oh my gosh, so many cute things. I just decided, let's see how how the quality is, you know, how everything fits, how everything feels. And I have opened a few things. I wore a few things, like I wore an outfit this weekend. It was super cute. I could probably pop a picture up. Um, but I will try on some things for you. Actually, I got this cute little crop top from Shein. It was $3, so I threw it in. It's got little coffees on it, like Halloween coffees. So I was like, I need some fun Halloween shirts. And I didn't want to spend like a whole lot on them. So I'm going to show you some of the fun Halloween shirts that I got. And I haven't even opened all of them yet. I opened a couple, but not all of them. So this one hasn't been opened. Let's check it out. I've got some other orders too. Um, some of them came today. Some of them came over the weekend. But I wanted some sweatshirts. That is so cute. Oh my god, guys. Look at that little print. It is a cute little skeleton guy with a jack-o'-lantern head. And he's drinking coffee. He's got a haunted house behind him. The coffee mug says, Happy Halloween. And there's a little owl. This is adorable. And I got a size small i like my sweatshirt i like like little cropped crew necks so i think this is going to be perfect oh my god so cute i will try to link everything that i got in the description box but i thought they had so much in the halloween um section that i just uh, i'm like there's not even enough days left until halloween for me to wear all this i mean i'm sure there is but i may have gotten a little carried away so here's another Halloween shirt that I got. So much fun. So I'm already excited and shopping for Christmas stuff now. Ooh, oh my God, ooh, this one's even bigger. I love that, spooky season, so cute. This one is more oversized, I would say, than the other one, or the other one's just probably more cropped, um, cause I believe I got a size small in all of them, but yes. So cute, I love this little print, spooky season. All right, so there's two sweatshirts that we got. What is this? This looks Halloween-y, I think it's like a pajama, like, I think they're called union suits. They're like just a onesie pajama. They're my favorite, I love those. Ooh, gosh, this feels quality heavy oh my gosh wow that is cute that seems kind of big though geez that looks big but maybe it'll fit when i have it on i'll try these things on for you guys oh my god but i just love these little um outfits i've got several uh of these in halloween and uh Christmas. I just think they're so much fun and i usually find a lot of stuff like this at tj maxx but I just wasn't seeing anything cute like that this year. So popped over to Shein, wanted some cute stuff, and I got these fun Halloween pajamas. And not everything is Halloween, so ooh, some stuff is private. <laughs> um, this I already opened. I didn't wear it, but I tried it on. It is um, a, bot a lace bodysuit. So that's kind of cute, like to wear with a pair of jeans or a skirt. And speaking of skirts, I did just open this one and try it on. It's just like a ruched uh, black mini skirt. I just thought it would be like a good staple piece to have on hand. You know, you can't go wrong with a black mini skirt, which is why I've got multiple. This is the one I wore 
over the weekend and I love it. It's getting wrinkled because of the way that I just threw it on the ground but it's got this like ruching on the side and a little slit and I will show you that one and I wore it with a brown bodysuit but it's not in here. I, I don't know where it is but very cute. Okay, I think these are fine. These are pajamas, I do believe. Some little pink pajamas that I ordered. Oh my God, look how cute at these little cute bottoms. And then let's see what we got for the top. So cute. That's just a cute little PJ set. I needed some new PJs. Another fun Halloween shirt I can see through. Oh my goodness. This is so cute. It's got this witch on it and she's so pretty and she's holding a jack-o'-lantern. And it says, Happy Halloween. Let me give you a close-up view. I love that, so cute. I think this is like a hoodie or a sweatshirt. Ooh, it's like, um, I don't know how you, what you call these necks, but I love these. I live in these. In the fall and winter, it's just like a cropped sweatshirt and I love this neck, like a mock neck. I don't know what you call it, but so cute. You could like bend it over or wear it up. Super cute, and I got this really pretty white. Ooh, I could buy one of these in every color. It's got a nice pocket. This feels really nice. It's super thick, so nice. This I already opened. It's just like a basic black dress. I had an event, I had an event to go to. I needed a black dress, and I was like, I don't have a cute black dress, so I just, wanted to get a couple dresses like that that I could just always have on hand and wear. And it's kind of hard to see with the ruching. It kind of makes it look weird when you're holding it up. But it's just a halter dress and it's just like a tight fitted dress and it's open in the back. Just a basic little black dress. Uh oh, got another spooky one. Ooh, and I love this color, the tan. It's one of my favorite colors to wear. <gasps> I love this one. This is so cute. It says spooky vibes, and it is orange with the little spider webs and the leopard print. <gasps> that is adorable. What an adorable crew neck. This is so soft and cozy. This one is on the shorter side. I don't know. I, I like them shorter. That is how I love my sweatshirt, so super cute. This is another a fun one that just randomly came up and I had to have, I did already open it. Um, so on the front, you got a little cocktail, um, a margarita, and the back I thought was so cute. It says, if you're gonna be salty, at least bring the tequila. That is so cute. And it's got the little skull giving the peace sign. It is just so pretty and vibrant. Oh my gosh. It feels so nice. It's like um, printed on. Kind of like if you made a, a shirt at home and did like the press and things. Probably like a lot of the shirts that people make, but that is so cute, guys. I will have to share all of this. Oh my God, look, you can tell. I think this is my third sweatshirt in this color. <laughs> oh, we got something else in the neutral color. I haven't opened this yet. I don't know what it is. What do we got? Oh, it's just a cute uh, fall top. And it's got like a scoop neck and like a blousey kind of sleeve. Oh my God, this feels, I love stretchy material like this and it's ribbed. This feels really, really nice. I really like this shirt. I think I ordered it in another color, but I don't think that package has arrived yet. Like I said, this is only like half of the stuff that I ordered, but I wanted to go ahead and open it. So I'm opening it right now with you guys. Oop, another, another one. 
Got another Halloween item. I think this is some sort of pajama. This was like three dollars because I was like, wait, do I need this? And I was like, it's only three dollars. Okay, my camera battery died, but this is just a cute little like night slip and it's just got pumpkins on it. So cute for Halloween. Love that. Uh, one more Halloween shirt down there. This is a t-shirt. So cute. This one has a little ghosty, a witch's broom, a witch's hat, jack-o'-lantern, some potions, spider webs, all the spooky, creepy stuff. And as you can see, that's like a um a cropped type. It's not quite cropped, but it's like just waist length which is perfect for me i'm a cropped girly i like everything short because i just don't i don't know I don't, maybe i don't have a long torso or something but i like to, things to come to like the top of my pants so i don't have to like really tuck it in a whole bunch so that is super cute i think this would look cute you know with jeans leggings a skirt i can't wait to make some cute halloween outfits one more thing in this bag I had a brown bodysuit, I think. Oh, what's this? Oh, another little, I think it's a shirt that kind of fits cropped like this. <laughs> oh my God, this is so like kind of cringy. It's like skeleton hands, but I think this was $3 too. And I was like, you know, I don't know. It's a little cringe, but it's kind of cute. And it's super stretchy. Oh my gosh. So cute though. It's fun. It's Halloween. We're having fun live a little all right let's see do we want to go to the next Shein box let's just start on top because i got other stuff so um i did order something from shoppriceless.com and i will share with you everything that i ordered i already opened one of the items that's it i haven't even looked at the rest but i needed a bag to carry the other night and i ordered this one and i was like oh my gosh this is the perfect bag this is super nice like I just think it's really cute. I love the shape of it. And you just open it up. And yeah, there's the inside. Just a basic bag. It's got a little zipper on the inside, but it's so cute. Like going out, it looks really cute. I don't have, I have like one black bag. So I'm not a big purse girl. I don't have a lot of purses. So I have like my Louis Vuittons. And then I just like, when you spend that much money on a bag, it's like, I'm carrying that thing forever. So, um, but yeah, you gotta branch out with different outfits. So I picked this up. Let's see what else. Guys, I needed clothes for fall. So I'm like, I don't have anything to go out in or anything cute. All I had was like a bunch of big sweaters and that was it. Like what was up with me in sweaters last year? Because I have a million. So this is the rest of the stuff. This one outfit, I just saw it so many times and I'm like, that girl looks so cute in it. I want it for myself. I haven't tried it on yet, so I'm not sure. Hopefully I look good in it too, but I thought it'd be like a perfect date night outfit. And I was thinking our anniversary is coming up. Maybe like if we go out somewhere, I would wear this, but I did order some boots to go with it and they haven't came yet. So I can't wear it. Until I get some boots. Sorry, this is loud. So this is a two-piece set. And it's like a faux leather set. Ooh, oh my gosh. Look at that. It's this cute um, dress. This cute little skirt. And it's got like a crop top with it. Oh, goodness. I hope that... That is... Ooh. I don't know. The girl made it look so cute, so... I'll try it on for you and see. Hopefully it's cute because, you know, I think I splurged on that. So what else did I get? Yeah, I did. So I got um, black vegan leather leggings. Not, I guess these are just regular leggings. I don't remember. Ooh, dang. These are legit uh, thick. 
So yeah, they're just like skinny at the bottom. Just a basic like black leather look legging. That would be super cute for fall paired with some tall boots. You can wear a cozy sweater with this. You can wear a crop top with it. There's just so many ways, a jacket, everything. Just a nice um, staple piece to have in your wardrobe is some leather looking leggings. It just kind of dresses up your regular leggings like for a night out or something. Just it's a little fancier. So those are my fancy faux leather items that I got. Yeah. What is this? I thought this was a sweater, but it feels like a hard object, so. I'm not sure. Oh. Uh, we've got some issues, guys. Oh, maybe it's just like vacuum pack, cause like, that is so weird. I thought this was like lacquered with something. It is a vacuum sealed in there. I don't even know how to get this open. Well, I've never got anything like this before. Let me go get something to open it up. It's too much. Okay. This is a sweater from Amazon. And it's just like this checker board print. I ordered boots from here. I've never ordered any kind of footwear from Shein before, but we're gonna see, we're gonna see how it goes. So, don't know what this is. Wow, this is a lot, I didn't realize. Oh. <laughs> This is, I, I'm living for Shein because this is cute. This is nice. And it's just open, it doesn't have any buttons. So it's just like a little um, jacket. So fun. I think I'm gonna be hooked on this. Ooh, 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 bodysuits. Oh my God, I've had the hardest time trying to find bodysuits. So this one, and I think one of them that I ordered was a petite, so I'm a little worried about that. I don't know if I'm considered, is this petite? Cause this looks long. Ooh, I don't know about this one. That looks like, like the neck's going to like, I don't feel like my other one came up that high. I don't know. You just gotta try things on, but I got this pink bodysuit. Fun, fun, fun. And then, Oh, I'm like, what is this? It's a little, one of these crop vests, I wear these a lot. Cause I'm always like, every day just looks, leggings, and these are so cute. In the fall and the winter to wear leggings, you can put this over a sweatshirt, a bodysuit, um, any kind of shirt, and it looks so cute. But I got this in black. I've already got a red one from like a previous year and um, an army green one or an olive green one. So I got a black one. I may have ordered another color. If not, I probably will. So, oh, this is cute. Or it looked cute. This feels good. Um, huh. It's a little awkward. But it's like a little, ooh, just like sleeves. I just bought sleeves. I didn't need the whole shirt. Just the sleeves. I figured the back might kind of like hang down a little bit more. Oh, it's not. What do we got back there? Ooh, I don't know. I've got a crop top on, so it's, um, so it's weird. But just cute little sleeves. So if you're wearing a crop top and you might get cold, just pop on some sweater sleeves to go with it. I just thought this looked cute and fun to just pair with like a dress or something. If you have a dress on, you can just pop this on. Thought it would be worth trying out. And that's like a really, it fits really good. It looks so weird, but it's got like a nice thick knit. Super soft and pretty. Okay, we got something pink. 
Oh, I'm like, what is this? Oh, it's a two-piece set. Super fun. Like loungewear, you know, like this. I need stuff to put on um, in the morning. Get the kids going. I need stuff to put on in the morning to get the kids going out of the house. We're going to school. Pop this on with like a jacket. I can just do my chores and stuff around the house and I'm feeling like I'm looking cute. You know, it's like if I feel from being ugly then I just, I feel that way on the inside as well as the outside. So I can't wait to try this on because it's just got this cute little crop top and it's kind of like feels, it's ribbed. It's a thick material. Like I'm, I'm shook right now. This is, if this looks cute, I'm probably gonna order more. I just gotta make sure like sometimes, I don't know, I don't want it to be like saggy in the crotch or something, but um, ooh, I think I'll save the boots for last. I'm not exactly sure what's in this box. Um, so, oh, that's in a top just a black top it's got a scoop neck and i love this material and i can't ever find it this one's a little see-through i will say that but i can't ever find this material when i'm out shopping and it's literally all i want to wear another top this one's got a pattern on it it's a little risky for me i like a lot of plain stuff but this is a cute pattern top a little like crop top I think it'll be really cute to wear with jeans leggings and this is a fun pattern I just like the browns the tans white and black got something orange I think this is an orange bodysuit it's a tank top one yeah it's an orange tank top bodysuit it's got a little mock neck I just thought that would be so cute for fall and Halloween like paired with a skirt some tall boots because it's not quite like cool here yet. Like you can wear a skirt and a tank top and boots and, and, and you're fine. So it was 80 degrees today. So I need some fall things that aren't like sweaters. So this is really cute and I'm super excited about this. It does look a little long here, but you know what? We'll try it on and see. Well, I'll style some looks for you guys. Some Shein looks. What is this? Okay, here's a, you know, I, I don't know that I like this bodysuit as much as the um, the brown one that I got, because I think this is a different, I don't even know what color this is, because it's not white. It looks kind of like, I, maybe it was like a tan, a cream, a cream color, so. Those two, that one and the pink one were the same kind, so. You know, the reviews, they were raving about that one. I don't know if it's the same or not. Uh-oh, this is something lacy. Ooh, this one's risky. This is risky. What are my kids doing? It is this, like, cute, sexy top. It's, like, all lace, and it kind of, like, goes around your neck like a choker, and then it is open, uh, like, above the bust area, and then it's got like this black faux leather stuff and it's lace sleeves and a lace back. I don't know, this may be, if that shirt doesn't work, I could probably wear that with that skirt. This is gonna be cute. Ooh, I think this is another two piece set. I am obsessed with two piece sets. I live for two piece sets. This I got a nice fall color. So I don't know what you wanna call this. It's like a rusty, um brown and it's this long top with the mock neck uh, i think these might have flare pants oh yes these have flare pants and this comes in like every color so it was like so hard to pick a color definitely gonna be trying that on i'm starting to think i ordered way too much stuff guys i'm feeling guilty i'm feeling really guilty right now okay but the show must go on, so let's try these boots because I'm scared. I'm, 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 I'm really scared, guys. So here is boot number one. And I mean, I know it's nice to invest in a nice quality pair of boots, but you know what? 
I'm on a budget guys so I'm like I want a bunch of boots and you know what these are looking good they don't smell that weird they feel pretty good um ooh, those are pretty nice you guys look at the heel I think this is really nice it's got a zipper on the side and um yeah I love these kind of boots they're kind of just stand up like this and so cute a perfect little brown boot for fall like I said I have a couple other pair of boots coming but these are an A plus I mean I haven't tried them on yet but they look and feel really good I mean if I buy I would compare it to like say I bought a pair, a pair of boots at Target or something so I looked at Target they didn't have any boots there were no boots so I'm like what can I do? I, mean, I want to get a pair of boots cheap and quick. And well, Shein for the win because they came quick. Like I ordered this a week ago. It took like a week to get here. Oh, so what happened was I wanted the black leather look boots to wear with this outfit, but they, they were in my cart and I was waiting around and they sold out. And I knew cause they were so popular, they would probably come back. But the day that I ordered, I was like, let me just order the suede ones, which is what these are. So Ooh, guys these are good looking and they zip all the way up and they're all suede even the heel these are nice like I'm I'm pleased with this boot you know it feels feels decent it's not a hundred dollar boot but you know it's it's nice and I think I I don't feel I feel like I got a good deal and my leather ones will be coming just like it. So I'll have two different looks. Okay, and these ones, uh, oh I'm so excited about these because, guys, I wanted a pair of pink cowboy boots and I was going to order these pink rhinestone ones. Well, I saw them at um the buckle and then i don't know i like i couldn't find them in the pink and then i was looking at them on amazon and um i was going to order a pair and then i go on she and, and they have the pink rhinestone ones there and i'm like i know they're a little bit more on amazon but i'm like i know if i order the ones on amazon like the, there's no difference the ones on amazon are going to be the same boot you're getting from Shein. anyway i didn't get the pink rhinestone ones i might later but i saw these other ones are like baby pink and no one in the reviews was wearing the baby pink ones, but they were wearing the black ones, which had super bright white stitching, which kind of would like, might seem like, ooh, that looks cheap. But actually, the more I saw everybody with their outfits on, I was like, those are kind of fire. And then the brown ones looked really good too, which is kind of weird that they're like crammed in here, but these are the pink boots, y'all. Oh. oh my God. Wow. These these are gonna be my favorite purchase look at that oh my god the lighting is just kind of washing them out you gotta get you gotta get a close-up view of this well i don't know what the lighting looks like but these are pretty amazing i cannot wait to style a look with these i don't know what i'm gonna wear them with but i just like knew that I needed pink cowboy boots in my life. That is definitely my most favorite thing out of this bunch. I do have another box like this coming, but I'm just gonna go ahead and you know what? I'm sure, I'm sure you've seen enough, but I did wanna show you my um, fun Halloween purchases from Shein. Just such a bunch of fun looks and I can't wait to style all of this and share it with you. Make sure you're following me over on Instagram and TikTok and Facebook so you can see all of the other fun stuff I post every day. And thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you had fun with this Shein haul with me. Now I'm going to style some looks for you, so stay tuned. All right, guys, I wanted to show you a few of the looks that I put together because um, I know it looks so different when you're just holding it up. It's nice to see what the things look like on, and I just wanted to try a few things on myself and kind of put together a few fall looks, but then I've got to cook dinner, so I've just put a few together, or I'm putting them together as we speak. So I put on this pink bodysuit that I wasn't sure about because it just kind of looked a little plain, but, I mean, this is what I love to wear because guess what? 
when we go out to like concerts and dinners and everything with all of our friends on the weekends and you know everybody looks cute and I want to look cute too so um I love to wear leggings like Lululemon I'm a leggings girl I've got leggings like always spandex so these are like dressy outfits you know you look cute but you kind of feel like you're still in leggings so that's what all this feels like um this is the pink bodysuit it fits perfect it said petite I mean um, I'm 5'4", so it fits really good. The sleeves are like the perfect length. And it's just a nice plain top. And I just like it because like um, if I'm wearing like lower jeans or something, it's just not going to like come out. I have a lot of crop tops that I wear with my um, high rise jeans. But I've been buying a few pair of mid rise. I think I'm going to go start going toward the mid rise. I feel like they're more flattering for my body type so um, yeah I don't my crop shirts aren't gonna work with all of those but the leggings they will um, this is the ruched mini skirt and it's black and you can see it's got like the I don't know what you can see but it's got the ruching on the side the ruching on the sides and it is just like such uh it is such like a basic staple piece I wonder if they have this in other colors because love it you can't go wrong and guys I don't know if you can see but I've got the pink boots. I've got to get way back here. Um, the pink boots on with this. <gasps> oh, oh, these are gorgeous. This baby pink color is beautiful. Here, let me change so you can see. I am in love with these things and they are so cute. I don't know. I think they were like $35, guys. You've got to snag a pair. They've got black, um, brown, white um they're just so cute they come up so high and like look how big they are they're nice and roomy and they fit um true to size perfectly um i have a size seven that's my normal size and oh my god the color of these oops i don't want you to see it my skirt but the color of these is perfect it's so gorgeous and the heel is beautiful they fit great like oh they feel great the heel so cute i'm pretty sure i'm going to get some other colors this is a little halloween pajama thing that i got and it's pretty big i've got several of these and they're like tight little suits so this i don't really love i mean it's cute but it is big on me so i would have preferred if it was more fitted but it's still super cute for some cozy fall pjs all right, you guys, my husband is going to be home from work pretty soon, so I've got to throw a quick dinner together, and I guess I'll show you guys what I make. Um, I've never made it before, but these are leggings that I got from Nana Max. I can link those, but uh, I just wanted to put on a couple of the little um, sweatshirts. So this one is the Spooky Vibe sweatshirt, and this is just its regular um, fit. And, of course, I'm going to, like, tuck it in crop it up I like to pull my sleeves up a little bit just super cute I am in love with all these little cute um Halloween sweatshirts but this one is super cute other cute sweatshirt I am in love with all these fall sweatshirts the vest you could just wear with anything I, and and with boots it would be so cute but I'm not gonna put the boots on right now because just too time consuming, but that is really cute. This one was a little like bigger, but it's still so cozy. I mean, sweatshirts are just cozy. And this one is the spooky season. Really love these. All right, you guys, I have played dress up long enough today. I am now going to go rush in there, make dinner. It is super late, but my husband's working late. So I'm like, oh no. I've been messing around all day and I didn't get any dinner made so I am going to make a quick and easy dinner that I just looked up on my phone and I've got it right here it's easy beef and noodles okay I'm sure you're like me there's just never enough hours in the day so I am making a late dinner I just checked my husband is still at work so I'm going to make this recipe that I've never made before and it's just this easy beef and noodles so we'll see if it's easy let's see what our ingredients are hopefully i have everything i checked the um yesterday because i had planned on making this so hopefully i do it says um it'll take 10 minutes to make um 20 minutes to cook so i think i can pull that off so we need one pound of ground beef and we get our beef butchered so i've got one pound but it's frozen so i'm going to put it in the defrosting in the microwave that's where we're at right now so we need egg noodles 
an onion, garlic, Worcestershire sauce, whatever, Italian seasoning, flour, beef broth, and salt and pepper. So sounds easy enough and I'm just gonna whip that together and we'll have like a hearty little dinner. And I've got a Caesar salad in the fridge, so I think that'll be good. And guess what guys, it is seven o'clock. <laughs> To the good days, here's to the sorrows. If this is a mistake, I know about tomorrow. I don't wanna fight no more, cause I don't feel the need no more. No, just wanna make it stop. Maybe it's something in the water, or maybe we just. Alright, guys, well, this is all done, and guess what? It is, I spilled flour all over my phone, but it's 7 32. So it said it took 10 minutes to prepare and 20 minutes to cook and that was exactly right. Here's the finished product and it looks really yummy. It's, it's just such a simple meal, but I think it was a pretty good, it worked out well for the night. That is it for the night. I'm going to throw together my Caesar salad kit and call it a night with dinner. I'll leave the recipe down in the description box below if you guys wanna try it. But again, thank you so much for watching and don't forget to hit that thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.